being able to go out to Normandy was a, was a very sombering day. It was breathtaking and very emotional to be amongst the thousands of Americans who were killed over the course of that operation. I actually took the opportunity to uh, gather some sand off of the beach to take back with me so it can be a, uh, a memory and a reminder of um, our fight for freedom. We all have such amazing passion and excitement and energy when it comes to the U.S. Women's National Team the flag that they represent the United States. Being able to go out to Normandy so close to the anniversary of D-Day and, and be able to experience that, it's a, makes it all a little bit more personal. When we did that march, it seemed like there was like only about 200 people. But as we went up this hill, up the mountain, I look back and it must have been a thousand people maybe, you know, yeah. 1,200. But then I turned the corner and realized there's about five, 6,000 people in the march. When they realized how many were going to our event, the police came in and said, we're gonna create a march route for you. Marching through the streets of Paris, shutting it down? Like, who does that? <laughs> they stopped the traffic for us. So that was cool, it was just literally honoring the American outlaws. People love it, it's just like, a, it feeds joy. Everybody was smiling, taking pictures. It was just joyful. It brings joy to people. They're applauding and they're chanting, USA, USA. It was very friendly. It created for one of the most epic marches we had. It was a very good entrance. It was quite theatrical. It's really cool. It's nice. You're just like, I'm, I'm, I'm like, we love it, we love it. <laughs>